Hi and welcome back to today's Morning Report Chart Appraisals on a Wednesday, the 22nd of October with me, Richard Fair Market Analyst at Handtech Markets. Let's move to dollar yen now. And again, another chart where we've got a lot of choppy trading. Look at these t last two trading days, um, completed trading days. Doji candlesticks, one higher, one lower. Um, and today we've got a red candle which suggests downside is in place. And to be honest, it's just indicative of what we're seeing across a lot of these dollar charts at the moment. A lot of uncertain trading, um, quite volatile in, in, in some ways, but obviously dollar yen being basically flat on the day suggests that um, that on a net basis that the dollar yen is fairly solid. However, um, across the trading days, it's fairly volatile. One one day higher, one day lower, and at the moment we're f we're sort of just drifting off a little bit. And it just um, as I said, looking at these hourly moving averages all converging to basically be flat. Momentum indicators basically flat as well, um, not really showing a great deal. And also on the daily chart, even there, um, we've got the RSI basically flattening off at 45, 46. MACD lines flattening off at neutral. So we are looking for signals really. Um, whether this um, whether this rally is able to continue or not remains to be seen. I did think yesterday with the early weakness in dolly yen that um, that the yen was beginning to strengthen again, and um, that was uh, just showing that um, the dollar, in my opinion, that was showing that the dollar was under pressure. But certainly the dollar's rebounded since then. But uh, isn't there's no real suggestion of any continuation of that rebound now on the dollar? The with the yen sort of seven pips to the good on uh, on the day it's not really it's not really continuing that rally so it's very uncertain trading i think across all the forex pairs but certainly on dollar yen being the main one um is uh, no real direction and uh, i think we need to wait for signals now what sort of signals would that be well certainly the support at 10622 is the key low from yesterday and then the reaction high 107 11, one, one, so 107 40 107 50 um on that daily chart you'll see that uh, 107 50 is the um is the limit of that uh, big bearish outside day that we had um last week so uh, that is the key resistance there on the upside 10750 but 10622 is also um the key support so i think we need to sort of just bide our time and see what um what the outlook's going to be when we break those levels really because there's nothing really showing through on these momentum indicators anyway i wish you good luck in your trading today and i will speak to you later thank you